Hey there, it's Jake here. Have you ever found yourself stuck with a device that has a blacklisted IMEI or bad ESN? It's frustrating, isn't it? You might be wondering if there's a way to remove this blacklist and somehow get your device back to normal. Well, that's exactly what we're diving into today. I'll be showing you some ACE methods to remove a blacklisted IMEI from your device, be it an iOS, an Android phone, or any device that uses SIM cards. Now, you might have stumbled across certain services, software, or methods that promise to solve this issue for you. But let me be honest, those often come with a hefty price tag, and worse, they may not even work. But don't sweat it, because I have something better for you. In this video, I'm sharing a safer, quicker, and free alternative that is guaranteed to work. So stick around, grab a note, and let's get that device back in action, shall we? Let's keep this simple, folks. This info is for folks who genuinely own their devices and just can't remember their login details. We're not here to help anyone do anything fishy like bypassing security on pilfered gadgets. That's against the rules. We're respecting laws and others' rights here, and this video sticks to YouTube's rules too. Now that we're clear, let's move on. Moving on, let's talk a tad bit more about the services that can help you with that pesky blacklisted device. Now remember, I'm not here to sell anything but just to give some handy dandy tips. First up, there's Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app. Super cool, right? It's a nifty tool, packed with some fancy AI tech that can swiftly help you remove the blacklist from your device. Next in line is Safe Unlocks. These folks really know their stuff, providing a legit and reliable unlocking solution that won't cost you an arm and a leg. And last, but by no means least, there's ESN Doctor. These guys have made a name for themselves in removing those pesky blacklists like nobody's business. All right, now that we've covered our options, stick around. Coming up is a step-by-step -step guide on how to use Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. Trust me, you won't want to miss this. Just a quick detail before we carry on. These unlock services typically operate in first world countries, but don't worry if you can't access them or would instead not use them. We've got a fantastic deal for our video viewers. Every week we give out 250 free unlocks. Yep, that's right. And entering for a chance to win is simple. All you need to do is like this video, hit the subscribe button and leave a comment below with your phone model like Samsung S9, your IMEI and your country. As soon as you've completed these three steps, you're automatically part of the draw. So get going and seize this opportunity. You might just be one of our lucky winners. Ready to remove the blacklist on your IMEI. Let's walk through it step by step. First off, fire up your phone or computer browser and head over to unlockhere.com. When you land on the page, you'll meet Nifty, the AI powered tool from the folks at Unlock Here. Just scroll down a bit and you'll see various options. For now, we're choosing the Fix IMEI Blacklist option. Next up, it's time to let Nifty know about your device. You'll see a list of all major and medium sized brands. Find yours, give it a click, and then hit the Next button. Now make sure you have your device's IMEI or serial number at your fingertips. Don't know where to find it? No worries. The app itself has a tutorial. On your phone's dial pad, just punch in asterisk number sign, zero six number sign. And there, you'll see a pop-up with your info, including the IMEI number. Now you're almost there. To complete your application, it's time to provide a point of contact. Your name and email will do. Please remember to read and accept all the terms and conditions of the app. Got any questions? You'll find resources in the app to help you out. Now sit tight for a few minutes. Once your request is processed successfully, an email with your unlock details will make its way to your inbox. Sometimes it might sneak into your spam or promotion folder, so keep an eye out there too. Finally, it's time to confirm and activate your order. Copy the verification code from your email and click on the Confirm My Order button. Paste your code on the page, complete the CAPTCHA and wrap it up by clicking Validate Info and Start Unlock. And that's it, you're done. Nifty will take over and wrap up the unlocking process. Just pop in a compatible SIM card and restart your device. As demonstrated, the IMEI unlock method proves to be highly effective, not only for the Samsung S9, but also for a wide range of devices. You can go ahead and give it a try with confidence, and feel free to inspect your device to ensure everything is running smoothly. If anything trips you up along the way, don't hesitate to chat with live support. They're ready and waiting to help you out. All right, guys, let's chat about some more alternative ways to clean up that blacklist from your IMEI. These methods are, of course, totally legal and above board. The first and simplest method is to connect with your carrier's customer support. Sometimes the blacklist can be a mistake and they'll remove it for you. 
Or if you've settled any outstanding payment issues, they can also help you remove the blacklisting. Then there's always the option of reliable unlocking services like Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app Safe Unlocks and ESN Doctor. These services can legitimately remove a blacklist from your device. Just ensure to pick a legit service that adheres to the law. Keep in mind that each situation is unique, so the effectiveness of these methods may vary. Always explore all your options and most importantly, use these methods responsibly only for legally owned devices. We're all in this together. Stay tuned for more handy tips. Remember, our goal is to provide you with the best possible solutions. Swing by soon for more insights on making tech work for you.